Hey guys, Shot Show 2020 here at the Salient Arms slash Archon booth. Who, if you haven't heard of Archon, don't worry. Garrett here is about to explain what's new in Salient Arms and interestingly, Archon, this German um, handgun that's coming to the US. Um, thanks so much, Garrett. Absolutely. So starting off, we'll do with the uh, the Salient. So uh, this year we released a few lines of uh, ARs, starting off with the green. Uh, this is our so-called base model, but it comes with a lot of sweet features. So it runs a full-length M-Lock rail, ambidextrous safety selectors, uh, radiant charging handle, our nitrided uh, carrier, and mil-spec trigger with BCM furniture all around. It does come with the Inbus Pro sights as well. 15 inch, 14 inch? So this is 11 and a half, but we also offer it in a 16 inch gun. So you can get it as a pistol, SBR, or a complete rifle. So this is our gray light. So what's cool about the gray light is it runs our, our QD attached rail. So just to kind of give you a quick show of that, if you don't mind, I can pop this up, take it off, oh, wow. and then you can actually access underneath the, the rail yeah. really easily. So if you want to run multiple rails with different furniture, you can easily swap that. One of the cool features on this is it runs a square 14 and a half intermediate barrel. Mm -hmm. uh, the flash hider is pinned, so it is a legal gun, you know, for 16 inch. Whereas the other one is not, is a, has to be an SBR. The other one, so the other one, you can either make it a pistol in 11 and a half or six, it comes in a 16 inch model as well that you can buy legally without having to have it pinned. This comes with uh, the Radian safety selector along with the Radian charging handle. And one of the cool features in this one is it runs our one piece bolt carrier. So there's no keys, no staking involved in the bolt carrier itself. Uh, same in-bus pro sights and mil-spec trigger on this one as well. So this is where things start to pick up and get a little cool. So this has the same QD attached rail, but the one big difference is we have our jailbreak. So this is the cool feature. So it comes quick detach right off. This allows you to run a QD suppressor mount underneath your handguard. And then when you're done shooting your suppressor and you want to be really loud, boom, you can click on your compensator. And now you've got a, a fully built-in comp that hooks on directly to your rail. Um, uh, question, suppressor, what is that uh, attached to? What is that comp attached to? So the comp attaches straight to the rail itself. Yeah. So this, oh, this is a surefire. Surefire gotcha. brake. Okay. Yeah, yeah, it comes standard on the gun. All the rifles come with surefire brakes. Okay. Uh, same Inbus Pro sights. Uh, same Radian safety selector, charging handle, stipple work on the BCM furniture, and the, the, the big upgrade is the Geisley trigger, yeah. along with we will offer this in a few different colors. So we have this like gray, silver here, and there will be some other ones available. MSRP starting on the gray is uh, $32.95. The gray light is going to be uh, $22.95, and the green, the green will be uh, $16.95. I like the green the most. Yeah, very the, slick, very simple. Yeah, yeah, very simple, slick, and it, you know, it's, it's going to be a good seller for us. I can see this one going very well. So one of the new things with, uh, with Archon, I mean, this has been around for about a year now, but we're really starting to ramp up production and get these things out into the market, is the Archon Type B. This gun, really cool, we'll start on the outside of it. Uh, basically, this gun was designed for shooters by shooters. That's, you know, that's the best way to describe it. So we got a metal trigger shoe here. So you got a real durable trigger. You don't ever have to worry about that ever breaking on you. Uh, we have a really cool grip mapping technology. So all around the grip, you'll see angles that go in different directions. This is to counteract the balance of the recoil when shooting the gun. So every time you shoot this gun, you can actually feel the different grooves and hold onto the gun a little bit tighter. Uh, it does come with an extended beaver tail and a this little notch back here is is, is really neat. So this actually activates the tendon in your hand, and once shooting, you can actually get a tighter grip on the gun itself. So the Archon Type P is one of the lowest bore access shooting guns on the market right now, and the reason for that is what's inside. So breaking this thing apart, full steel rails all the way through, uh, and we run a horizontal style uh, uh, sear. So what yep. that does allow you to get a better purchase on the gun and a full full size grip. Very simple. Very simple on the internals. Yeah, very simple. So three-piece guide rod with the last spring being interchangeable, um, and then we will get into the cool, rotating barrel. The rotating yeah. barrel. So this is this is what the real cool feature set is on this gun. So I'll show you you guys real quick. Basically, put in our speed lock, lock it in place. 
So as the gun sits and fires, there is only about an eighth of an inch movement. So it moves very slightly. And that slight movement is all what cycles the gun. And that's why you get such a flat shooting gun or flat shooting feel out of this gun. Gotcha. And you know, with it being such a low bore axis pointing out on this rifle or this handgun, you get, you know, you're pointing basically right where you're aiming. So it, it's a very natural feel when shooting the gun. Looking down sights, very comfortable. Definitely interesting, you know, something other than, you know, a Glock whatever or 19 whatever. Right, right. It, it's meant to sort of feel like a Glock in your hand, but then once you start getting into digging into it, there's a lot more that goes into the gun, which makes it a real smooth shooter. Um, these are how much? So MSRP on those are 850. Okay. And they are available shipping right now, so if you are interested, check us out on uh, archonfirearms.us. All right, and um, different versions. The, there, there will be, yeah. So we do, we are working on some other uh, variations of the Archon. I don't know if I can talk about everything just yet, but we do have some plans coming out. Would this be considered a full size? This is actually be considered a compact. compact? So we, okay. we are looking to do a full size and then a subcompact. Sounds good. Cool, Garrett. Thanks so much for. Uh, Hey, absolutely, thank you.